Uh, Vancouver Canucks, they're celebrating Halloween, so we had a chance to go inside the dress room. A couple days back, we talked to them about scary movies, who's celebrating Halloween for the first time, and who dressed up as Marilyn Monroe a couple years back. The answer's revealed right now. Exciting times here. Um, Halloween's coming. You ready? Not, not really, actually. I don't have a costume yet. What? Yeah. So. Well, you know, we got some suggestions. We've been talking to the boys. They have some ideas for okay, you. Okay, I'm, I'm willing to hear them. Well, hold on. Let's, go, let, let's take a trip down memory lane first. What have you dressed up as in the past? What has worked well for Manny? Uh, Mr. T has been a favorite. A pity the fool. Yeah, a pity the fool. Chuck Norris hey, was Chuck another. Norris, was yeah. another one of my favorites. And uh, a Hooters girl. You still have that outfit? I do, somewhere, oh. yeah. It won't be coming out ever again, <laughs> but I do have it, yeah. Any big costumes in the past uh, for you? A couple of years ago, uh, me and Kess, um, we were, uh, we uh, dressed up as uh, Elvis, and he was uh, Madonna, Madonna, and uh, that was pretty, uh, Marilyn Monroe and everything, so that was pretty funny. K Kessler was Marilyn Monroe? A uh, long, long time ago. What's Halloween like uh, in the Sedin household? Oh, a lot of trick or treating. Yeah. Uh, mostly treat, treating. Uh, When's the last time you went trick or treating? Man? I've never done it. It's the first time this year. What? Yeah, uh, Halloween is not a big thing in Sweden, so it's uh, it's the first time for for us. So who do you think would make the best Justin Bieber in the locker room as the captain? You know, what I mean, you're assigned in roles here. Who would make the best Justin Bieber on the team? Alex Edler. <laughs> Without hesitation, Edler. Yeah. Sure. I think uh, maybe some guys will maybe Jer Jersey Shore this year or something like that could be a good situation. One. Who would be the best situation here? Maybe a guy like uh, Rick Rippin. I think he could be uh, pretty good up there. Is that a situation or two to deal with? Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Who's doing Jersey Shore here? Is anybody doing Jersey Shore this year? I think Manny Malhotra's got the abs for it. That's for sure. Yeah. Situation from Jersey Shore. Uh, your name came up. Your thoughts? <laughs> um, they said you had the abs for it. Uh, I'm, that's very flattering, but uh, I don't know if I want to be put in that kind of same realm. He's doing big things. Did you see him on Dancing with the Stars? Admittedly, yeah, I did see. I, 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 <laughs> my wife watches the show, it's so I'm, it's always the wife. You play the wife. Watch it, yeah. You got a favorite uh, scary movie when it comes to Halloween that you like to to pop in? Uh, I don't like scary movies. Mm -hmm. No, it's not my thing. To be truthful with you, I don't watch scary movies. I never, I never have. I just don't enjoy them. I was like uh, uh, Chucky. <laughs> You know what one of the scariest movies of 2010 was? Uh, no. Sex in the City 2. Just when you think you've seen it all, it hits you. It's horrifying. For any guy sitting there covering his eyes the whole damn time. It was a nightmare, man. I know. It's terrible. <laughs> Nothing at all. Exorcist. Shining. Oh, no, no. I just... Armor. Uh, no, I can't... Saw. No, I got that. When I was younger, I watched Friday the 13th. And Something was, happened when, when you were younger. Was Let's go there. Young. I was way too young to watch it. We're a bunch of buddies were at my friend's house. Parents weren't home. Yeah. Friday the 13th was on, and I don't think I slept for about two weeks. So. Jason did it to you? He did it, yeah. Every time you see a goalie, is it flashbacks? Little bit, little bit, and uh, Freddy Krueger got me. I don't watch the ads now for the new movies about Freddy, so. Sorry, I, I can see it's, it's got it's a It's painful, impact. it's painful, it's good to talk about it. It's you good to talk about it, thank you. You wanna? No, that's, that's, that's enough. We'll you wanna hug it out? Yeah, well, sure. That's enough for me, yeah. Uh, okay. Happy Halloween, man. Thank you very much. Thanks for doing this. Yeah, Sorry that I had to have it. It's <laughs> <That's laughs> awesome. Man. Thanks, man. I, I like how you, you're a little bit of a therapist. You, you know, know we, the they, you just got to get it out. I was there to listen for the boys. Yeah. Friday the 13th, that got me too when I was younger. Well, you know, when I was in Edmonton, uh, a few of the Oilers, of, of course, would hand out uh, candies and stuff, and they always did the full-size bars. None oh. of that mini bar for no. them. Give me business if you're going to hand was. out that candy. It was all good.